and welcome to Revelation X as we get underway with the Revelation X number one contenders tournament. As always, this is Steven Rogers calling the action. Give me one moment, ladies and gentlemen. Get the chat up here open. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are ready to go here. Number one contenders tournament. The winner will face the RevX World Heavyweight Champion next Thursday. And you know what? We're going to go from the bottom and work our way up in this tournament. First up, it's going to be TJ Ace versus The Enforcer. Dustin Jeffries. You gotta imagine what Jeffries is thinking. He wants to get back on the winning path. The current reigning and defending Pro Wrestling Revolution World Heavyweight Champion. Dustin Jeffries is coming in here knowing full well that if he wants to get back to the world title, this is really his only shot to do it. So tonight, this is his opportunity to try to get back to that world title. Again, I'd like to thank you for tuning in, ladies and gentlemen. Well, now, been crazy work schedule, later show date, show airing. Um, waiting to find out what's going on next week. Hopefully, back to somewhat decent time. And here comes the enforcer. The following contest is the championship, European championship first round that he match. won. Making his way to the ring from Indiana, weighing in at 245 much pounds, went the European champion, pro wrestling world anyway. Champion. Had a European Championship. The Enforcer, I believe that Dustin promotion was called. Jeffries. Yes, I'm getting here is XWA. He was the XWA European Champion. Never lost the title. He is still the current reign defending PWR World Heavyweight Champion. He is, and I believe this is the first ever meeting between these two men, TJ Ace against the Enforcer. Ace, a former RevX Hardcore Champion. So Ace is going to be looking to do what he can. I mean, like I say, he's going in the ring with the Enforcer. Jeffries is not someone to take lightly. And his opponent. From Oak Park, Illinois, weighing in at 189 pounds, T.J. Ace. The Ace of Revelation X, T.J. Ace. 
looking to make some major, major waves here. Walking by the enforcer as Jeffrey's on the outside. TJ reeling off that defeat from the superior one Spike. I mean, you never know. With Spike being in this tournament, he could very well be facing Spike sometime in this match. Well, let's broadcast. And here we go. Fireman's carry. Kryptonite crunch. Oh, the box. Yeah, I think you pissed off the enforcer. And he's going for a ride, pump handle. Jeffrey's trying to put the boost in. Oh, kick that cut. Swift's the leg. Into a triangle. Jeffrey does not want to be there. Jeffrey's is in trouble. Left hands find the mark. Jeffries does not want to be in that triangle. Just ask Spike about it. And again, triangle again. Jeffries, I mean, he was touching the ropes. Surprise, I mean, I don't know if the ref did not see it or what happened there. It's not Merrick, kick right in the back. Make it two and woke him up. Oh, run a knee. Just jack the jaw, Jeffrey. Look at this. What power by TJ Ace. The Ace of Revelation X. This cooking. Ooh, shoulder right in the back. And a quick pin. Only a one. Jeffrey picks him up. Oh, big slam by the enforcer. Gut wrench now. And down with a set out D-bomb. Does not go for the pin. Oh, look at this. Oh, ho, ho. trying to snap the man's arm. Putting the boot to him. Double stomp. And one for the kick got caught. Nice dragon screw. Shades of the great Lulu with that. Up the kick, Jeffries now. And with this, here we go. Sanchez is in that Quebec crab. Shades of the model, Rick Martel. Oh, one for the try drop kick right in the knee. For the gut kick down the mark. Jeffries trying to get some go, but gets cut off. And just being stalked. Oh, God. Burning hammer! Ace with the burning hammer. One, two. Oh, man. Jeffrey's got the shoulder up. Right after the two count. Jeffrey's short on clothesline. Dead with that gut wrench. Maybe another D bomb. Yes, he does. He goes for the pin. Now, look at this. Another quick pin by Jeffries. Jeffries putting the push and Look at this. Dead lifting. Poke him up. And another set out D bomb. Yeah. 
kicks to the side of the head. Gets pushed away. Son got a right hand, it was tumbling down the floor. Scoops up, no, out the back door. Wants a chop, running knee, missed. Jeffrey's back in. Irish whip. And how about that little receipt from earlier with a shoulder? Jeffries, what in the world is he taking the, sh the pad off? And an elbow right to the back. Oh, Enforcer landing. Down he goes. Jeffrey scored the Enforcer's landing. And taking another buckle pad off. Look at this, setting him up. Double leg. Here we go. Cry for help. But A's not having it. Right hand. Oh, ho, ho. And an exposed turnbuckle! Back suplex, neck breaker! One, two, three! This match should be over! One, two, no! This match should have been over! Flipping backstabber! Go for the pin on the backstabber. And no, Jeffries kicks out. That exposed turnbuckle came back to fight Jeffries. Up and down. But in a way, it kind of saved Jeffries as well. Can you smell it? Can you smell the rain? Southern rain by Jeffries. Going for the cry for help again. Has it locked in? He's in the middle of the ring. Can he hold on? And he does. Jeffries can't believe it. The ace withstood the cry for help. Jeffries hit off his big maneuver. Oh, got caught. Drop kick. Got a kick right in the ribs. Oh, look at this, Jeffries feet on the ropes. Ref. Only a two, ace. Front face lock. Slaps Jeffrey right in the head. Straight jacket, German. No bridge, all impact. Jeffrey with a big scoop slam. Oh, he went for a, what the, why would you get? Bridge, you're so good, disqualified. Bomb. Why would you risk yourself getting disqualified here? Modified surfboard. The ace making his way to his feet. Elbow right in the ribs. Or knife edge. Rolling backstabber again. Ace quickly to the pin. One, two, wow, A 
Grace cannot believe it. So, so close. Oh, man. Burning hammer coming. Down. He got him. Jeffrey split wide open. One, two. He beat Jeffries. TJ Ace has shocked the world. He's defeated former world heavyweight champion. Scored the enforcer's landing. Was able to get out the first cry for help. He ate the southern rain. Here is your winner, T.J. We're still at the second cry for help. The biggest victory in this young man's career. He has knocked off the enforcer. Wow. Well, as somebody who won't be facing the champion next week, it will not be Dustin Jeffries. He is out of there. And now, another first. Jason Parker against the show closer himself, Showtime. How about this for a match? Wow, what a shock. TJ Ace knocks off the enforcer. Wow. I don't not know about you guys, but I mean, I'm shocked by that. Two burning hammers later, TJ Ace knocks off Jeffries. He will face the winner of Showtime and Jason Parker. First time ever these two men going at it. First time Showtime is making the following contest is a championship an first on this round branch. match. Making his way to the match. ring from Hartford, Connecticut, weighing in at 241 pounds. Showtime. Showtime. One half of the ego powers with Stefan Sugar Hill. Will Showtime, I mean, will he be able to also be able to become, win this tournament and become World Heavyweight Champion on this branch? We've seen him do it on the Fire Pro branch. Heading that show closer on Fire and X-12, can he do it here? We will find out.
There he is. Showtime making his debut here. As he goes against the undefeated Jason Parker. And his opponent from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 220 pounds, Jason Parker. Last time we saw Jason Parker last Thursday, he defeated Zach Jarrett. The Chaos Kid representing Hardcore Chaos. If Hardcore Chaos is still around, I mean, seems like it's been dissolving. And here we go. Parker snap suplex takes over Showtime. Slugging the right hand. Not Mary takeover. Going for the kick. Showtime gets out the back door. Stabs him right in the back. The show closer. Get that European uppercut. Rights and lefts. Kicks. Back spin kick. No one home. Spinning tornado DDT. By show climb. Parker gets out of dodge. He's back in with a right hand. Oh, kick got caught. Big clothesline got evaded. Parker spins him around. Straight jacket German with the bridge. Logging in that rings of Saturn. Shades of pack. That version of the rings of Saturn. Showtime fights out with the he got caught. Back the other way, nice sweep. A mandible claw. And takes the elbow to the back. Needing the body by Parker. Goes on to the back, now on the pin, 9 on one Parker will be good, look at that Parker's law. Spinning Brain Buster by the show closer. Ooh, shot the ribs. Double leg. Hammer fist now. No time. What in the world we got going here? Oh, hello. Eat a knee. Show closer coming. Down he goes. Parker is down. Two. And no, Parker kicks out of the show closer. Jason Parker showing a lot of heart and resilience. Oh, swinging flatliner. And no, just caught Showtime out of nowhere with that. Showtime ate that swinging flatliner right back to the rings of Saturn. Scoops up and big slam down. Stumps the body. Near the back of the head. Look at this. Now just gloating. As only Showtime can. Nice arm throw there by Parker. Parker likes using that Parker's Law. Parker's lower left 
Double leg takedown again. Showtime is laying down the blows. Jumping and stomp. Sets him up. Rear chin lock now. Trying to slow down Jason Parker. Hogan got in touch with Revelation X, saying he wants to be a part of this company. Well, Parker is here, elbow the body. Ooh, forearm shot there, cut the kick. Stormbreaker! Short arm shoulder block. Oh, the back, down he goes. Parker gets out of that short arm shoulder block of his own. Oh, got blocked. Show closer again. I think the back of his head hit the rope. And Showtime knows it. Possibly. And it does. Showtime advances over a very game. Jason Parker. So it's going to be Showtime and TJ Ace. What's going to be left in the tank of the show closer? Or what's in the tank of TJ Ace later on? Look at this. Running, bam, a running knee. There's the first show closer. Look at this, that swinging flatliner caught him out of nowhere. Here is your Showtime winner, Showtime scored that Showtime. second, that second show closer in the back of his head. Back up Parker's head, hit the bottom rope. Hopefully get the EMTs to check out Jason Parker. Because, I mean, hopefully he did not suffer concussion due to that blow. And now, ladies and gentlemen, two men who don't like each other at all. And I'm being told that they're already down the ring ready to go here. But they're on... They're on the outside of the ring on separate sides staring a hole to one another. I mean, they did not waste any time. There's no glitz and glamour between these two. Ken Washington, multi-time hardcore champion over in UWA, former PWR World Heavyweight Champion. Spunk's a former World Heavyweight Champion. Current UWA Tag Champion with the legend as the Superior Legends. Also current United States Champion. And Spike running European uppercut. Hop up. And a German. No bridge. Absolutely no bridge. All impact. Spike that's taken down the clothesline. Kick right in the back. Forearm shot. European there. Oh. Slapped him right in the face. Gets caught. Coming blow the back. Boom right to the face. 
of the superior one. Like just getting hammered. Short on shoulder block board. Stomping the body. Ooh. Spike with these blows. I mean, this Sunday. He's going to be um, going after Ali Monais for the hardcore title. Lion Salt Springboard and no. And the boots to him. Press up. Good Foster. Ken Washington. And ladies and gentlemen, if you know it, uh oh, I thought we was gonna see it. Oh, kick, uppercut. Spike, I don't think you wanna be in the corner. Spike pushes away, Ken Washington. Front face look by Ken, lets him go. Oh, pop up, German, as the superior one arriving in pain. Look at this. Oh, stomping the arm, quick into the pin now. Only a one. Mike rolls out of the ring, right back in. Oh, nice right hand. Blue Thunderbomb. Didn't have enough to keep the pin. Spike now. He'll be looking for that drive by. He's back. And he is safe! And Washington split wide open! European coming! No! I thought that springboard European was coming up! And the big man gets up with a Famouser! Shades of badass Billy Gunn! Highly doubt Ken Washington is an ass man. Uh oh, capital punishment coming. And he nailed it. One, two, only a two. Superior one knocks off Ken Washington. The drive by Washington did hit that capital punishment, but there was no pounces in this match tonight. 
Look at this. Boom! There's the capital punishment. There's that springboard line sword or an acai moon sword if you'll call it that. Running superior knee. Just jack the jaw. And then the ripcord superior winner. knee. Spike. A spike. Sticks it to Ken Washington once again. Wow. But now Spike must be looking on because he knows he's going to be facing one of these two men. It's going to be Jaden Shadow or it's going to be Brian Hux. And Hux, we know. Last time we seen him, the UWA Rumble, he wanted to get his hands on the legend D was brewing with him for a moment till D hightailed it out of the Rumble. Would later come back and win the whole thing, become world heavyweight champion, then lose it to Mr. Main of Bank. The juicy one, Mike Dixon, who's the current UWA world heavyweight champion. Jaden Shadow's been hardcore champion. Hux, multi time submission champion. Two men, no stranger to gold. Hux, I want to say one of the longest reigning UWA television champions seen in quite a long time. I mean, I, when you think of long title range, I mean, Graves with the United States title comes to mind. But Jaden Shadow and Brian Hux. Shadow will be looking for the peace of mind, his spear. Or the shadow out, that burning hammer of his. Hux will be looking for the Carolina Slam. Most hated men in the industry, Jaden Shadow. We are getting word that Dustin Jeffries has left the, the building. Following contest is a championship first round match. Making his way to the ring from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 205 pounds, Jaden. Jaden Shadow. He is ready to do battle here tonight. Can he get the job done against Brian Hux? And we will see, I mean, Hux did get his revenge on the franchise, Vince Griffith, making him submit to win the submission title. Shadow 
anxiously awaiting the arrival of Brian Hugs. And his opponent. Here he comes. From Greensboro, North Carolina, weighing in at 355 pounds, Brian Hicks. Brian Hugs. He is ready to take care of business. He will hit you with that Carolina slam. His spine buster. Not very many men survive one, let alone two. And here we go. Alex trying to put the boost to him. Oh, he got a hold of him. Shadows up. Oh, and down the vertical. Big Brian Hux is laying in the right hands. Hux not wasting. Oh, what a DDT by Jaden Shadow. Unique reversal of that scoop slam. Shadow just spiked him on his head. He's right to the back. Unique leg submission. Hugs might be in trouble here if Hugs doesn't go get out of this thing. Shadow lets go of it. And look at this. Just taunting. Brian Hugs, oh, he went for the knee, got caught. Right hand, another one on the way down. Back elbow. Body kick, make it two. Kick right in the ribs, and another DDT. And a bite on the fingers. One forearm shot, knee. And knee to the back. And Hux is down on the outside. Shadow going to of it. Throwing Shadow back in the ring. Shadow rolled out of the way, but takes an elbow to the back, blocks a knife edge. Ooh, forearm. Hugs with a clothesline. Right hand. Around we go with the Olympic slam. Carolina slam floats over. One, two, and Shadow got the shoulder up. That's now. Drive right all his weight down in the back. The right hand. Hux getting fired up, but right now. Took his eye off the ball now, Shadow. Giving him the blows, giving the walk forward. Now Shadow, drive by of his own, and hugs a split wide open. Going for the pin, two. Jaden Shadow with the drive by, knocks off. Ryan Hux. There's the Olympic slam. There's the Carolina slam. 
And Jaden barely missed those ropes. The drive by the force of those boots. Guaranteeing the victory. Here is your winner, Jaden. Jaden Shadow. He will be facing the superior one. But now we're going to see TJ Ace and the show closer, Showtime, go at it. These men going to do everything in their power to walk away the winner here. Showtime would love to walk out here and earn a earn the right to face the World Heavyweight Champion, whoever it may be, next Thursday night. But Ace, a former hardcore champion. I mean, he knocked off Dustin Jeffries. The, a Grand Slam champion knocked him off. Can he do the same thing to the superior one? I'm sorry, to the show closer. My bad on that. I mean, the superior one's in action next after this match against Jaden Shadow. The following contest is a championship tournament semifinals match. Making his way to the ring from Hartford, Connecticut, weighing in at 241 pounds, Showtime. Showtime making his way out here. Back again. This is a, again, as I said, I cannot stress this enough. A big time opportunity for Showtime. Gotta imagine he wants this opportunity really, really badly because yes, he's held the world title world in the fire pro branch. He would he wants to win the world title here. He's been UWA champion. He's been PWR champion. Imagine rounding it out, the triple crown. Can he do it? We will see if he can. TJ, but TJ Ace. This, this is really a must win for him. If he does not win tonight, then where does he go? Where, I mean, where does his career go from here? 
if he does not win tonight. I mean, and his young man, TJ Ace. Weighing he does not at win. 189 pounds. Man. T J Ace. Who knows? I mean, who knows where or when he'll ever get a shot. I mean, this is this is it. This is his opportunity. He does not do it here. Then I mean that's it. He goes back to the drawing board. And here we go. Showdown will kick the ribs. Stormbreaker coming. Oh no! Nice Frankensteiner out of the Stormbreaker. Stomp in the back. Bulldog driver. You are not going to be showdown with the Bulldog driver. I'm sorry. Not this early in this match. No matter how much punishment he's taken. He was shot rush to the throat, but showed him the backbreaker. What the hell? Well, I, I mean, I'm seeing my, I see Kane. I see Kane's video. Wait a minute, that's the big room machine, Kane! Tombstone! Tombstone Showtime! Ace! Trying to make his way to his feet! As he continues to hammer on Showtime, the show closer fights out of it. Well, he tried to get near the ribs. Oh, nice close on by Showtime. Hit to the ribs. One and knee. And Ace is split wide open. And Showtime with that running knee. Gotta imagine not happy about taking that about taking that tombstone powder from Kane. Look at this. Boom! Running knee right in the head. Splits him open. Two, three. TJ Ace's winner, dream. Showtime. Fizzle out as Showtime goes to the main event. Goes to the finals of this tournament. Who will he face? Who will he go on to face? Will it be Jaden Shadow? Will it be the superior one? Who will be number one contender?
And these men are already in the ring. These men as well, they said, forget the entrance. We want to fight. This is a big fight feel here. So, ladies and gentlemen, don't forget this Sunday we will do a special um, 11 a.m. show. Yes, 11 a.m. So, while you're eating your lunch, you can come by, watch the show. Mike making his way, Jaden just, oh, nice modified STO. Mike from Dream Street taking a kick. You gotta imagine, I mean, Showtime with hopes, these two men just wear each other out. Running you almost like a modified blockbuster. Gotta wonder what's left in the tank for these two men. Takes the knees. Missile drop it from the second turnbuckle. Spike's coming. Running forearm. Went for the boot, but Shadow got out of there. Spinning tornado kick. Finds its mark. Shadow. Duck under, takes a clothesline from the superior one. Now, near the back of the head. Almost uh, what we've seen Showtime do earlier. Oh, nailed the V trigger. Get the superior one a knee of his own. Warm. Kick from right in the leg. Running blockbuster. Shadow, what in the world is he doing? Oh, he went for a hole. Was he going to go for his own superior knee? Vertical suplex. Put on the chest, but no, not happening. European uppercut. Went for the V-trigger again, got his leg caught. Went for the Blue Thunder. Oh, what a kick! Not biting the fingers. Oh, wait a minute. Samoan driver hooks the legs. One, two, no. Jaden Shadow can't believe it. Trying to figure out what he's got to do, but right now the superior one. Have everything well in hand. We'll see the third drive by of the night. Shadow hit it earlier, and Shadow split open. But not going for the pin off that. Leaping flatliner. Oh, here we go. Ripcord superior knee, rumbles in the pin, two, and no! Jaden got out of there. Spike cannot believe it. Lion C 
Somersault connects. Sparks says it's time to finish this. Modified figure four there. Not enough to put Jade down over the pin. Two, no. Shadow a bloody, bloody mess. Spike having his way with him. Shadow, hard Irish whip. Just verberates out of the corner. Top wrist lock now. Shot to the ribs. Make it three. And this chunks him over the top rope. Side. Spike going to the top. Elbow finds the mark well in the back. In the corner he goes. Stomping a mud hole. Oh, the insult from the superior one. Superior knee. Shallow out. Down he goes. Stomping for it. Just the hell of it. And Jane and Shadow puts down the superior one. Jaden, there's the Samoan driver. We thought he was there. I thought he had him. Drive by. This time Spike scores it. Ripcord superior knee. Thought he had him there. But not a chance. I got that modified figure four, went for the pin. Not happening. Here is your winner, Jaden. Jaden Shadow will go to the finals. And ladies and gentlemen, Shadow staying out, staying out here in the ring. Showtime making his way down. As we are getting ready for this match, how much is left in the tank? You gotta imagine not much is left. Shadow, showtime. These men one of these men will face the world heavyweight champion next Thursday.
Who will it be? any time he went right after him showtime huh? wasting nothing he wants to get this match over with I mean imagine I mean this match goes will favor Jaden Shadow. And just throws him away. Kick. That's how he won the early match earlier. One, two. No. Tom cannot believe it. He in the fact that modified him a clutch. Show closer! Just like that! Whoa, 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 whoa. I could have sworn that was a three. The referee said it was a two. That was Damn close. Flipping head scissors. Jaden Shadow. In control. He must stay in control. If he does not, then he will not win this match. Oh, what a knee coming. does 
now the second on the turnbuckle just taking a breather he is waiting for him there's a Samoan driver one two and Showtime kicks out again the show closer Kicking out, side headlock. Jaden trying to think, like, what the hell do I gotta do? The running knee. Get the shadow out. Show closer. He got him out of nowhere to scoop him up. Pulling him away. One, two, it's over. gentlemen like to thank you for tuning in as we will see you this Sunday 11 a.m. grab your lunch sit back enjoy the show we got a great show lined up for you the superior one spike against all Monice for the hardcore title. And I'm sitting there trying to look at my notes here. King Rockstar Devitt will face Devin Harrell for the World Heavyweight title. Casey will be going up against Lexi Monice for the Women's Championship. Tag titles on the line as the Untouchables Lukey Murphy and Brandon Alexander will defend their titles against Hollywood Elite. You do not want to miss Sunday's event, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for tuning in. We will see you this Sunday, 11 a.m. As I said, grab your lunch, sit back, enjoy the show. We hope you enjoyed tonight's event. This is Steven Rogers signing off.